You've invested, of course, in technology as well. How, how important is that in the mix in being able to, to be flexible and diversify like you're talking about? I think everybody in this game knows how difficult skills are to come by in this game now. Um, you either bring apprentices in and train them yourself or you fight for the good people that are out there still. We've gone down the road of automation because it helps us to get more throughput through the factory and just relying heavily on skills of one man, one machine. So we can have one man, four machines, for example, sometimes, but it largely depends on the kind of work you've got coming through the workshop at the time. So the man for us has always been the workhorse in our factory. We've always managed to fill it with work. Um, it's a reliable machine, it's very accurate. Hardly any downtime on it. Spin all time that is don't great. Know, the MAM is a, uh, a multi pallet solution, isn't so it's it? 32 pallet, five, uh, full simultaneous five axis machining sensor. Um, it's certainly changed our fortunes around. We bought the, the MAM and um, work came in quite quickly. And from then on, we pushed further and further into four, uh, five axis machining all the time. So we've got a lot of five axis capacity here now. And we try to run spindles as much out of hours as we possibly can. So if the spindle's not running at night or weekends, we want to know why, you know? As long as the work's there, for us to put on those machines, they will be running weekends and all night as well. And obviously that cost benefit gets passed down to our customers. And when you look at machinery though, do you ever consider alternatives or do you kind of go to Matsura and say, what have you got that will fit my needs now? Or do you go, do you broaden your, your vision and look across the whole industry, but you just always come back to Matsura? So, I look at everything in the market base, obviously, but it's just, the old thing is, I fix it if it's not broken. You know, we don't have any issues with Matsura. Uh, the service is good, the machines are very, very well built, and the accuracy is fantastic. Um, so, yes, I've looked at other things. As you know, we've had other machines in this place before as well, but the accuracy and the uptime we need has been given to us by Matsura.